SpecEc is an FTIR accessory company. We're based in uh, the UK. We have offices in Fort Washington, uh, Pennsylvania, and around the world. Well, the FTIR accessories that SpecEc produces are ATR, transmission, gas cells, process cells, and sample preparation accessories. Now, going through them, the ATR, we have several different ATRs. The first one is the Golden Gate, which is the, I would say, the crown glory of the uh, SpecEc accessories. It is the one that we've had around for close to 30 years. It is a monolithic diamond ATR. Golden Gate has several different top plates, so it's not just an ATR, it has several different ones. It has a heated top plate that'll go to 200 degrees C. You can do polymer melts with that and look at crystallinity differences and uh, kinetic reactions. We have a reaction cell that you can do small volume reactions. We have a cryogenic cell, uh, low temperature, and that goes from, you can know, put uh, liquid nitrogen in there and it'll go all the way up to 80 degrees C. And then if you're doing uh, supercritical fluids, we have a cell for that that can withstand 5,000 PSI, and uh, it's also heated with that. The next accessory we have for the ATR is our Quest. The difference between that is you can change the crystal materials very quickly and very easily. We have two different diamond uh, top plates for that. The standard one has an AR coating on it, which will give you higher throughput. The other one is our uncoated, which is our extended range diamond, which will get you into the near, uh, the far infrared. That has a very wide uh, wavelength range. With that, we have other uh, crystal plates that go on that, zinc selenide, germanium, silicon, and either a specular reflectance. And the other one rounding out the ATR is our uh, gateway accessory, which is a multi-reflection ATR. The next one is transmission. We have standard transmission cells, and we have the Pearl, which is the newest uh, transmission cell that is out there. We have several oysters. Yes, the oysters are on the inside, the Pearl's on the outside. Fun to talk about. Uh, but you can change the uh, path length very easily, very quickly, and it goes from 25 microns all the way up to 1,000 microns. And then the gas cells we have are the Atmos, that is the newest one on the line, and that has four fixed path lengths, two and a half meter, five meter, 10 and 20 meter. Well, with the FDI accessories, I've already started with the Atmos gas cell. That um, <clears throat> came out of a project that we were doing for one company. And I said, let's make this a permanent project, a permanent accessory. So we made it a two and a half meter, a five meter, 10 meter, and a 20 meter fixed cell only. We also task the engineers with reducing the volume of the cell and increasing the throughput. And the engineers did a great job and they accomplished that. The other accessory, which actually is not an FTIR accessory, but it goes to the uh, XRF industry. It's a brand new uh, die in the Apex die. It's really interesting. You could take and just fill up your sample in there, put it in the press, and the press we have is the uh, auto-touch press, which is, you can pre-program it. Put your sample in, put the die in, push a button, come back, and the die will press the pellet and eject it. So you can go pick up the pellet and go right to your XRF very quickly and easily. From the engineers, to the marketing department, to customer service, right down to the production. They all take pride in their work, and they work with very high quality. You can get more information at SpecEc at the SpecEc uh, website. There's plenty of information about the products. You can get the data sheets, application notes, and even some of the manuals are there. There's plenty of information. You can get the contact information where you can contact us by email or even by the phone.